Initiating startup sequence. everybody, it's Boys of the Most Toys coming at you again with my fourth reboot of my Mini Transformers. This time it's G1 Starscream. If you haven't seen the T-Joint, um, Optimus, Soundwave, and Megatron rebooted to the new ball-jointed form and the upgrades, uh, then please check my channel for those. This one, although I'm usually an Optimus guy, may be my favorite of my new reboots. Looks very much like the cartoon. He is the largest in his alt motor vehicle mode, but he does transform as a robot as the same height as the other three. Let's stop yapping here and get right to transformation. So the first thing you want to do, flip up tail fins like this. Take your wing sections up, rotate them around, get them out of the way for our later transformation. And this could be somewhat tricky sometimes because everything here is a quite a tight fit. So we just about there. Okay. There we go. And same with the other side. That one worked a lot more easier. Then we want to transform uh, or take back the nose cone section. Just get it out of the way for now. And put it probably about like there. You gotta get him up to a standing position, flip him over, and I'm just gonna raise the camera for you guys. Which you can see when you flip him over, he's pretty much in his robot mode, just like the original G1 toy was. I'm gonna flip out this section out of the way at the back. We'll get it out of the way a little more. There we go. Flip out the feet. I didn't change much about the legs, except now they're ball jointed instead of T jointed compared to the old model. Pull out the feet. They can still twist, so it helps for posability. And we'll just get him standing like this. Okay. So, like I said, I'm kind of, this is kind of my favorite so far uh, of the four I did. I may do some more, but these are the four of the rebooted ones I did because I like to work in a larger scale, of course. But I'm running out of shelf space. And with a newborn at home, I don't have a lot of building time. So you may see more minis in the future. Um, so then to finish transformation, of course, we just want to, this is something new and it, it may or may not work very well today. Uh, we want to flip out, well, it's not too bad. We want to turn this 180 to make it more looking like the uh, cartoon version um, where the intakes kind of went the other way, which was different from the toy version if you had the original. And it's just a bit of a pain to do because it's really tight. Everything back here. And then we just want to flip up the head. And we're pretty much done. So repose the, the wings however you like to get that nice star, star scream look. Get him all posed up. And uh, that's about it. So again, as I said, guys, I think I'm liking this as my new favorite of my minis rebooted. Um, if you uh, hope this inspires you to build your own, remember I do sell the small skeleton that's similar to this on my eBay page. You can check that out in the description and you can buy a frame and maybe make your own Transformers or other Gundams or action figures. And uh, that's it, guys. It's pretty cool. Like I said, I'm really liking this one. Um, and uh, maybe we'll see some more in the future. Don't know. I have been asked to build a micro bumblebee or a mini, mini bumblebee, which I guess would be a micro bumblebee. So it's going to be about that big if I make it. Um, so it may not be very detailed. I may do it. I may not. We'll see. Anyway, I'm thinking about it for those who have been asking. Anyway, until next time, everyone, happy building. We'll talk to you soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Take care and happy building.